We're here in Birmingham, and I think it was notable that Theresa May, on day one of this conference, tried to stop speculation over exactly when Brexit would be triggered. The so-called triggering of Article 50, which starts the two-year process of removing the UK from EU legislation. Let's listen to what Theresa May told the conference. There will be no unnecessary delays in invoking Article 50. We will invoke it when we are ready, and we will be ready soon. We will invoke Article 50 no later than the end of March next year. So clearly we now have a timetable. We also heard that there will be a Great Repeal Act that rolls back the 1972 European Communities Act under which UK legislation ultimately follows European legislation and which gives the European Court of Justice primacy over UK courts. So we have a programme for rolling that back as well. Two critical points here, though. The one piece that was missing, we do not know at this stage exactly how negotiated access to the single European market will happen. We also are still unclear as to what extent there is a red line over immigration controls. And as you know, this is a key issue when it comes to negotiating with Brussels over future tariff-free access to European markets. So we have the sandwich, but we're a little short on the filling as far as the real meaning of this process is concerned. Wilfred, back to you. Hey CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the eye right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.